What is up guys, today I'm bringing you episode 3 of my FIFA 13 Ultimate Team Road to Glory and I want to say thank you for yesterday's video. You guys absolutely crushed the like button and I want to say I really do appreciate all your support. I asked for 15 likes and in a matter of 2 hours we already had got that and that was just amazing. And uh, at 18 views, 13 likes, that's pretty beast. So I thank you guys for that and we go into our first match in the bronze tournament. And the guys in this tournament is not really good. As you can see, 56 of chemistry is terrible and he will not be the biggest challenge and we do indeed win the match. But uh, my defending in this game is, I don't really know, I'm okay at defending but sometimes give away the stupid goal like this guy did right here. Massive defensive error and I just crossed it in the back of the net with this guy. Herard or what you want to call him, the pronoun my pronunciation of the players in this game is not something you need to rely on because I absolutely is terrible on that. So we get our second goal right here, just a really crappy goal actually, not really that good. But we managed to get it behind the goalkeeper who's just failing. Bronze goalkeepers are terrible and this is his goal right here. Just sweaty, bad defending and just, you know, I was really mad when this goal got in because he didn't really deserve it. I had all the game. I had a lot of game and possession of the ball, so I was I decided to crush him and played around nicely and uh, dig by or dig by got in the clear and finesse is in the back of the mat. So it's 3-1 right now and we are winning and this guy is not playing really well with his 50 say chemistry. I don't blame him because he's probably new to this game and I knew what I was doing when I built this team. So we get our fourth goal right here just to maximize or not maximize to get our coin total a little bit higher. And get uh, a little bit more coins for scoring those goals. So the match ends 4 1, and we move on to the next bit of the tournament. But uh, there's only going to be one match this episode, guys. But the next episode, we have two matches coming up in the Bronze Cup. But uh, so far, we just need to do some trading because I wasn't satisfied with our center forward, that guy right there. That's the guy we have currently. But as you can see, there's only two center forwards in the CF uh, position. Uh, in the in the in the league I am building right now, so that is just annoying I tried to search and try to see if any CAM was uh, transferred to CF or any strikers was transferred to CF So I was just searching for a really really long time and this is fast forward guard take that in mind So yeah, it's just terrible. I didn't manage to find anyone and we actually only come out with one player that we buy but that is also a hell of a good player, but uh, none really related to uh, the strike of position, but at this point in uh, FIFA 13, I think skill skill moves are kind of like, I don't really know. Sometimes it's fun to skill and sometimes it works, but uh, it's kind of hard to skill. It's, it was much more fun to skill. In uh, FIFA 12, there were a lot more 5-star skillers and beast silvers in, than it is in this game. But that's just the way it's going to be. I actually still quite enjoy skilling in this game, even though you might not see that in the upcoming episodes because I need to get the team sorted out, get the players I want in my team and just before we start doing any fancy goals, I just want to take the win, secure and easy before we start doing anything crazy about the skill moves, yeah? But I did actually try to do some skill moves in the next episode, you'll see that coming up maybe, but uh, I don't know, I didn't manage to score any nice goals yet, but I, I did manage to win. But as you can see, I'm just trying to see if there's any fast, uh, fast defenders in the CB position, but they were just too expensive, and our gingerman was doing great in the center back position at the moment. Just he is a perfect ginger, just our oh man for the job, seriously. And as you can see, I'm just trying to look at these guys, setting some of them to the watch list, trying to see if I can get some open bids on some of them, and just looking through. And I slowed down at this point because I could smell something in the horizon, you know. I could just smell it, there was a 4 star skiller somewhere hidden in these lands. So I looked over the horizon, skimming out of the open land and tried to search him down. He was hiding really well, but there he was, he was coming out of his hole, he was uh, hiding, but I did indeed find him. A beast from Ireland, a absolute tank with 81 pace coming up here, just checking the skiller moves and he is coming up right here and there is going to be our man, the 4 star skiller. Kearns or what you want to call them. The pronunciation is once again not my favorite part of this game So don't quote me on that, but 350 coins by now It was just too good to say no because for star skill moves is just so fun And when you play against your opponent with a bronze team They don't really expect you to come up with them four star skill moves do they there ain't really that much of a four star skill move bronze players in this game So when you play with a four star skiller against those terrible bronze defenders, there is just a whole pile of fun so after considering if that's your buy him, 350 coins, I finally go out and I do it. This guy is the man for our team and he will come in handy with those 4 star skill moves. Absolutely amazing player and I played with him in the next two matches you'll see in the upcoming episodes and he is a really really good player and, it, and I 
have gone some really nice skills and getting close to score some goals. So I put him in the position, uh, and as you can see, the mm, the striker on our team is not linking up really well, and our chemistry has fallen down. So we need to sort that out. But uh, I think we, I, I tried to search for some players here, just trying to see if there were anyone that I could use, uh, trying to see if anyone on open bid. But I want someone with pace and good shooting, about above the 60, 60 shooting. The 50 shooting is just terrible. They can just not do anything. You can see I'm trying to search for some striker because I, I'm not playing with 87 chemistry. Not enough for me. I want that 90 plus chemistry to play well. But as you can see, I'm trying to search for some players, but it, I can't really find anyone. But uh, you're going to have to see what I come up with in the next episode, maybe. Or otherwise, I'm, I don't really remember. But anyways, guys, the episode is coming to a close. If you did enjoy it, please hit that like button. And I actually got another Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. So let me tell you guys, if this video gets 15 likes, I'll upload a really beast Moab team deathmatch flawless on bootleg tomorrow so 15 likes and we got ourselves a deal okay so leave a li hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already and uh yeah this is our team at the moment so i'll talk to you guys next time peace